go. All right, what's going on down at the track? Nathan Warson, Warson Media. Look at this guy, looks like an alien. <laughs> what are you seeing? I'm seeing the back of a go-kart right now. Going under the tunnel, coming around. So, so tell me when you're flying this drone and you do this for pretty much any business in and around the Lake of the Ozarks, right? Yeah, business, real estate. Anything that, anything somebody wants me to fly or take pictures of. Is there any limitation with your flying ability? I'm gonna say, yeah, there's always a limitation, you know. Minimal. You know, fast, slow, uh, tight spaces, um, you know, anything, anything that you can get the drone into, really. You can fly this thing through houses. I do, yeah, that's, that's actually the main thing that I do with it. So we're going 20, 15 miles an hour is how fast these golf, these carts go. So you're even looking at a, a, a speedometer inside of that. I do, I have a GPS on it. You have to have remote ID now, and so part of that is having a GPS and a remote ID module on the drone that's sending out a signal telling people who I, who's in the air and what, what's going on. So that in, that in turn gives me speed. <laughs> So these carts are going about 15 miles an hour. We are at uh, Winter's Circle Go-Karts, Osage Beach. Nathan has come out here so graciously to do what he does best. Yeah, to, uh, and you've got a gig tonight. You're going to another uh, racetrack tonight, right? Yeah, going to I-44 Speedway in Lebanon for their, uh, their, opening, their opening night tonight. What would you say is the craziest, craziest run you've ever done with this drone? Um, craziest thing to do with, with the drone for me is tr is to chase the dirt track because it's it's dirty it's nasty it's fun you get right down with the racers you know have a good time and uh yeah it's just and it's you know you're going 60 miles an hour trying to stay locked onto a car it's it's an adrenaline rush for sure and you fly this thing you chase boats i have chased a few boats yeah um, haven't done as much with the boats as I have cars, but that can always change. <laughs> it's pretty It's pretty incredible watching your hands. It's like you're barely even moving the joysticks, yeah, or the, so it seems. The drone, uh, the drone actually drives, it, so it flies manually, is what's called manually. And uh, so when I push the stick forward, it moves forward and stays going forward until I tell it to go the other direction. Wow. So everything you see is is stick input to make the drone, like it won't hover in place like a DJI drone. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it, if I let go of the sticks, especially in this wind, it's gonna, it's gonna just go away. <laughs> Bring it back over this way. Okay. Let's get, a, let's get a good look at this drone. So this is not your grandfather's drone. You cannot buy this online. And you and you build this thing out. You uh, you modify it. Yes, sir. Yeah, I actually put this one together just this week so that we could chase the chase the go, go karts with it. If somebody wants to hire you, how do they do so? Yeah. They uh, yeah get a hold of me on Facebook, TikTok. Uh, Instagram. Under anywhere. what? What's the name? Warson Media. Warson. At Warson Media. Warson Media. Awesome. Yeah. Appreciate you, brother. Yeah, man. Appreciate you.